Welcome back to Tires Traveling Paints. Today I'm going to work on either a coat hanger or a leash hanger, one or the other. Hi. Um, so I painted this off with black just to help with um, absorption because I'm going to eventually epoxy this. So, <coughs> excuse me, the colors I'm working with today. Vermilion. Well, right now. I'm sure I'll work with other colors later. Fuchsia. Burgundy. And my iridescent is going to be Plum Crazy Purple. I'm going to use a white base. And I have my gray cell activator. I'm, I'm really into those drizzle drips that I did the past yesterday. I went crazy. I'm going to do it again. I think they're beautiful. Um, Shaniqua wants to sit outside in the sun all day, but I want to get this done. So I have um, Sergeant Art White right here, soft body paint mixed with Floetrol. I put a little bit of water in these in the colors uh, because I wanted it to be a little thinner than I had it, but I didn't add anything to the ready pour because I believe that's already as adjusted as it could get because I've had it for a while and I just keep adding a medium to it and that's awesome. So we're waiting on two, three presents for Shaniqua. And that is, um, she's got a new collar coming. She's got a jacket coming. Um, cause it's getting, it's going to be winter one of these days. <laughs> and, uh, this morning certainly felt like it. So let me go ahead and get this coat on. I sanded this wood first as well. And I'm definitely going to have paint left over to scrape, so I better make sure I can scrape it. Make sure I don't have too much of my hair in there. Yeah, I'll be able to scrape it. Because I like those leftover custom colors. They're really cool. I'll probably work with leftover paints later. What are you doing? What are you getting into? Yeah, she just wants to be wherever she can. I'm just pushing it around a little bit. I'm not going to go too crazy with pushing it around. I want to have a nice puddle. Because I'm going to spin this, so it's going to work. Right? Right, Fancy? Can you see her? She's a good girl. This is white paint right here. Yep. What I do need to have ready is paper towels. Because I'm going to drizzle. Swipe, spin, and wreck. Maybe a little tilty, tilty, too. What do you think about that, Shaniqua? So her name is Fancy Shaniqua. Wayne really likes Shaniqua, so that's what we're going with. And I like it, too. So let's go ahead and uh, see if I can... Get a nice drizzle going here. I think I'm building these colors up in the right way to give the most dimension. The thing I love about this is the dimensions you get from it. I mean, I can't wait to epoxy yesterday's work. I just can't. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here goes the burgundy. Yeah. 
then the purple. I think it'll be very interesting to say the very least. Might as well finish the purple. Now I think that purple has a little bit of silicone in it. But that's all right. A little ain't gonna kill nobody. All right. I'm just like, what on earth is happening? This is so exciting. Thank you, Kathleen Miller, because this is just deep. Oh, my. Look at those cells. It's really cool. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna spin and see if I need to do more swiping. I don't think I do. I don't think I do. We all better watch out because this spin is gonna get crazy. That's pretty. Okay. I think I need to do a little tilting. So I think I should put some gloves on for that. I gotta get on Amazon and buy some hooks. Cause so far I have enough for one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 
so far I have eight things ready to go. Or eight things that are gonna go. Oh, nine. So I'm gonna need to get some hooks. Because I want it ready for people to be able to get Christmas presents. I think that's all the tilting it needs, I think. Whatever doesn't get completely covered is fine, because I do have the wood painted. It's kind of neat, actually. Some pretty stuff right there. That's really something. <sighs> it's very gentle turns, but I don't want it to go flying. I'm gonna have to start over. It's extremely busy. I'm not sure quite how I feel about that, but it's really pretty and it's just going to get better looking as it gets dry.
feel like I need something. I need one more thing. some ice blue on it. Oh, oh yeah. That was a great idea. That really... I love that ribbon stuff. Oh. Well, now, where, the thing that I've got to worry about right now is where am I going to drive at and keep working today? <laughs> oh, man. I don't know. Hmm. All right. Let's get you in for a closer look. Because, <clears throat> uh, it's definitely you need to see it up close. Let's see about getting out of this without ruining the video. I did pretty good. Tons of cells, holy. Didn't expect it to sell up like that. It definitely doesn't have the same feel as yesterday's, but it's a different thing altogether. So once this dries and I get it epoxied, that vermilion's really gonna pop out. I can feel it. Yeah. Huh. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today and I'm going to find a place to try this and we'll get back at something. Bye.